okay guys so now that we have loaded the data frame and we have checked the number of rows and checked the number of columns uh, next what we want to do is you know look at the structure of the data frame and then we see we have day temperature wind speed and event okay and then we have one more column which is the index which is 0 1 2 3 4 which doesn't make much sense so what we want to do is remove this and probably make day as the index right so the first thing that we need to do for this is we need to check out here print df dot d types and what this will do is give you what type of uh, data each column has so for example object is a string this is a float this is a float and this again is a string so these three look okay but the date should be a date time uh, you know format so I think we need to change this so what we do over here is we can just go in here and then we reference the day column okay and then we go there is a method pd dot to date time df day and then you can give it the format person see so this format needs to be uh, exactly like your current format is so like date month and then year so you need to tell it this format if the format is wrong it will give you an error so let's do this okay and then I think you need to quote this as well okay oh, date time so this looks okay so let's try this okay and now we have an error complaining about the format but I'm not sure why uh, I think we need to add a slash here yeah I think this is it okay cool so now we have converted this so what we could do is again um, just check this print df dot d types okay so now this is a date time series or a date time format okay so next what we want to do is we want to set this day as index right so currently it has a inbuilt indexing but we want to make this day which we have converted into a date time object as the index so it's very simple to do that with this okay so data frame dot set index day and then in place true place true set index yeah I think this looks good so this is referencing to the date column and then this should work so now what we have done is we have made it a custom index so if you do this now we see the data frame has changed and the day has become the index and also if you do uh, df dot d types I 
like we did here, df.d types. Print this right. So this D type is you don't see the day column now because this has become an index now. So that's the reason we don't see the day column, right? So thanks. And next, what we're going to look at is check the type of data columns and get the count of values uh, for the categorical data. Thanks, bye.